Bum, bum, bum. Welcome to Bob the York Plays Battletech Rogue Tech. This is episode 22. Attempting to steal Capellan mechs again. Yes, last time we stole from them, we made off with an urban mech, which was cute, but not quite what I was looking for. So, we're told that there's a damaged lance. Hopefully this is true. And we are going to attempt to take them. And I want to get reasonable salvage out of this. Um, I think probably... Yeah, let's try to get some good salvage out of them, and hopefully this isn't so bad. And I've got money, so I can afford to do this. So let's try this out. And... We have also upgraded the Hunchback. We added a handheld rocket launcher, which is kind of sexy. And let's move the Sentinel over here to your normal spot. We have our Swordsman. Let's get you in there. And our Panther. I need to clean up some of this other stuff. But are you our panther with the PPCs? Or with the ER large laser? Yeah, that's the right one. Alright, so we're in pretty good shape. Let's do this. And hopefully hopefully we're able to steal like a 55 tutter. That would be great. So we're going to do this while uh, eating breakfast. So nothing meets uh, nothing beats uh, nice breakfast and lighting capellans on fire. That's right. Barbecued capellans. Although we don't have any flamers, we just have lerms. So lerms and lasers. Mm. But that should be sufficient for the task. And then maybe we'll farm a little bit more money and get out of here. As long as there's good missions, I can stay on this planet. But I really need to get another good, solid... Good solid medium mech. I really want like a 55 tonner. Kentaro would be nice too. A bunch of SRMs just to walk up and to splat somebody. That'd be kind of cool. And I'm thinking of rebuilding the Reactive hunchback. Instead of having all the lasers. I may put a couple of PPCs. Just have it do just sort of a big punch. Now let's see what we got. Alright. So they're down here somewhere. And let's go find them and see how badly damaged they are. And... We will let the planetary government people do most of the scouting for us. And the rain is going to be very nice. Alright, so. Enemy Lance is hiding there. And you probably have some support somewhere. I've got this water, which will be nice to fight in. I could deploy behind this hill, which is kind of what I'm thinking, because I have this bad feeling that this is going to be an ambush again. We could drop down here. Yeah, I think that right in this little nook, I think that's where I want to be. Alright. 
There we go. It's out of sight. My tanks are protected. Alright, so. You guys are going in that way. And then we're going to try and ambush you. Hmm. So, Receiving you. I want you to go scout a little bit. with your nice sensors and kind of want to hit them from behind in here but I don't know where they're at yet so my guess is they're not gonna be that <sighs> this the water goes all the probably going to end up being in the water over here, so... Alright, so let's... Can we... Alright, let's just, let's just start running out there with you. And we'll send the sentinel out. Swordsman out. And we will have you guys just hang out here. I'm just gonna chill out. There we go. So let's see what we find. I guess the allied units are heading towards us. Maybe. So I can't sprint out of here, so I would have to jump. All right. I guess we're jumping out. All right. Enemy contact. Yeah, let's just jump you out there. And... Got it. We'll see what we run into. Here we go. I think these guys, we're gonna sorta... hang you out over here. I don't really want to get too exposed until I know where they're at. And... Ooh. Where do you? Croissant. That looks like a little industrial mech. Alright. Do you have your spawn, whatever? No. It's 26 to hit you. And it's not awful. You got cover. You've got a heavy chainsaw, light AC2. So you outrange me. 
but you don't outgun me. So... We could sprint. And let's get behind here. On my way, double time. Ooh, there's a Clint. All right. So another croissant, Clint. A Whitworth. That's a forty ton. All right, so I guess I'll shoot you. So these are crap so far. So what else do they have? Surely they have more than just those four max. Move over here. Get to some cover. Seventeen. All right, we'll fire on you. Copy that. Zoom. We get a couple hits. Yeah, I got a few hits out of that. Kind of soften you up a little bit. That's good. You missed. Good job. All right. You are too far away for me to hit anything. But I want to be low, because I don't want to get into direct line of sight with you guys. All right, so we're just gonna we're gonna we're gonna stay kinda low and out of the way. So, Mr. Scorpion Light Tank. Really don't want to waste the shots on that. What do you have to hit? Well, those aren't great. So let's get behind cover. Roger. Okay, so we're we're just gonna wait. And look at this. We got this handheld lerm. And CERM, it's a little multi launch rocket. That is so awesome. So let's just get into cover. We're going to stay low behind this hill. Try and draw you guys in, and then hopefully you'll engage. Ouch. It's not quite what I wanted. How heavy is that Whitworth? Good to go. It's only forty tons. Two Lerm tens. So, I could try and ding the croissant. Kind of 
kind of want to hit that Whitworth, but... Actually, you know what? We're going to reserve you. What's right to hit on you? 14. Let's go down low. Into the water here. 12, 10, 14. No, it's no good. Alright, so we're just going to wait. What's up, boss? So 15. Those aren't very good odds, so let's just zip on over here, and we're going to, we're just going to wait for you to get a little closer. Standing by. You know, we're just going to reserve you, actually. That's what I should have done with the tanks, too. Ow, fuck. I hate these guys. Yeah, I hate Capellans, too. Got something you want done? Heavy chainsaws is 29, 51. Alright, let's go nail the Clint. Mm. There we go. That was a good hit. Aye, aye. Croissant, Clint. Let's get the Clint. Let me accept that missed. It's okay, we got you. Alright, so, I can probably out-trade them because I'm in a pretty good spot. Ready for order. So if you just don't have good to hits with your... I don't really want to stand out there in the open, so we're going to... We're going to move on up. And... 25, 22, all right. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna use swarm missiles on the Clint. Roger. Zoom. I'm just kinda tickle you both. Right, so Mr. Roberts. That's not going to be very good to hit. So, we're going to stay low. Actually, we're going to sprint. And we're just going to go over here and stay low. And maybe we can fire in directly. 8%, 12%. I don't care if I run out of these things, so. Ooh. I guess you were sober enough to line that up. I could maybe take that Whitworth and turn it into like a trebuchet with two learn 15s. That might be a possibility. Order. Let's 
Let's just do that. Let's get in the water. Sixteen. Yeah, we'll we'll take a shot at you. Ah, we got a little bit of damage. Oh shit! What's that bullfinch having it? That was a rotary cannon, I think. Shit. I'm under heavy fire here. Yeah, no kidding. What do you have? You got a light rotary rifle. All right. Twenty-eight or twenty and twenty-two. He's the bigger problem right there. So let's see if we can light you up. Probably going to have to present myself as a target. Twenty-seven, seventeen. Let's see if we can hit that guy. Okay. Let's go mess you up some more. I'm here. How bad are you messed up? Oh, it's your arm. Is there anything in this arm? Mean debuff? I don't know what the mean debuff is. So I don't think you've got anything in there. But I don't want you losing it either, so. Thirty-three. Forty-six. I mean, we could try and mess up that Clint some more. Although I really don't want to be the primary target for you, so we're going to... We're gonna go down like that. At 30. 17, 17. We're just gonna mess up your day. Thanks, we're gonna mess it up a little bit. Mr. Clint. Receiving you. You are I really want to get closer before I unload everything onto you. Let's march on up. You can be the target for a moment. 25. What do you have in there? You're, you don't have very much, but we'll... We'll just blast you. Okay. Yeah, you're not going to have a good day. I'm not too worried about you, but... I want to at least have a chance to hit something. Yeah. 
These guys really aren't that badly damaged. Alright, so my two hits are not good. If I walk out here. That's going to be a solid hit. Well, so so solid. Learn five. No, I think we go for the Clint like that. I'll save the rockets for when I get a little closer. Well, let's see here. I'll hit with one out of four, so I'll hit maybe five rockets. I'd rather get a little closer when I shoot that. There we go. Standing by. And we're going to Confirm. let's go take out the Clint and we'll use the rockets on you. There we go. You are screwed. Alright, good job. Yeah, you don't have your main gun anymore, buddy. Good to go. Twenty nine, twenty one. Ah, let's just learn you. Yeah, you're you're not having a good day. Good to go. Twenty-eight. Yeah. Now let's see how you handle this. Let's see how you handle this. And I could. You don't have any weapons left. You're basically kind of screwed. Let's do the regular blurbs. Yeah, we'll just blast you like this. There we go. All done. There's only three of you guys. This is really sad. I'm going to get a whole bunch of useless salvage, I think. Well, no, that with worth would be... wouldn't be awful. Showing minor damage. All right, let's go here. That's a thirty and thirty. What's, what's the range? Six seventy. Oh yeah, we're not gonna hit you with anything else. Nope. Nope, nope. However, this will mostly be painful. Mm. Wow. That rotary cannon is so nasty. Even if it's just a rotary rifle, it's still pretty nasty. just jumps through the water. Uh, we're not going to hit you very easily. No, we'll just brace. Receiving you. 15 to hit. That's not great. 5. All right, let's just go here. And... See if it's any better. 13, no, not really, but screw it. I've got plenty of ammo. Or not. Alright, well. 
important negative damage. Yeah, I noticed that. Fifteen. Yeah, a little bit of hit. How's it going? How's it going? Alright, let's Locked on target. Let's launch these at you. We're getting a little bit. And we'll just wear them down slowly. Holy crap. It's almost kind of like a little cyclops. Okay, we're just gonna... Alright, we're gonna just move on up. And keep firing. I guess there's not really any easy way to do this other than just walk on up. Alright, we'll just walk on up. Don't really need to build up the large laser heat. We'll throw some lerms and get a few hits. That was kind of cool. Ready for orders. Twenty-five. Let well, have it. Oof. Good shooting. Yes, Commander. Twenty-three. Yeah, we'll just. There we go. Yeah, we're just gonna just wear you down because I don't want to lose my hand. Waiting for orders. Roger that. Sploosh. Target confirmed. There we go. We got a few hits. Forty six to hit. I'd like to get closer, he's just he's so far away. Yeah, screw it, we're just gonna shoot you with this thing. And that works. Let's go light you up with that too. So many missiles. You sure did. You sure did. Ooh, crap. That's not good. He ejected, so we're going to be able to salvage it. I mean, I really don't need another 40-ton mech. But I guess it's better than nothing. I guess we'll see what it is. Come on, game, don't keep me late waiting. 
I've got all this terrible salvage to sift through. Gotta sort out the crap from the even crappier crap. Okay, well, we got a little bit of money. Got some experience, which is helpful. We have a lot of salvage. Got a, so we have an entire Whitworth. It's a 40 ton mech. Has. We'll take you. And I really don't care about a chainsaw. That's dumb. Jump booster pack. Adds unique upgrades to the back. Special slot requires 30% carry capacity. Three jump capacity. Well, that's kind of cool. I'll I'll take that. All right, so fire control is AC two. That's actually not necessarily bad. Especially since we don't have a choice, because there's just not a lot else for me to take. <laughs> So we'll take that. Don't need another Clint. Don't want a croissant. I guess. Uh, what's the most expensive thing here? 75,000. It's a piece of a Clint. Heat sink. What is this chainsaw worth? 100,000, so I could sell it for 10. This is just awful. All right, we'll take the chainsaw. I took so much salvage and I got screwed. Oh, all right. I think that's that's going to be a calling it a night. That's pretty rough. I mean, at least I got some money out of it. But I should have gotten a lot more. I might be able to turn that Whitworth into a Lerm support mech. Just give him two Lerm 15s and just lots of ammo. Make a little baby catapult. So... All right, well, we stole a mech from the Capellans. It just wasn't... Yet again, it wasn't anything that we really particularly wanted. But that's that's what it is. Somewhat mediocre scout and light strike platform, the Whitworth has seen service across the inner sphere. Since the end of the Age of War, a 40-ton mech, the Whitworth is powered by a 160-rated fusion core and mounts four jump jets. The Whitworth is armed with a trio of medium lasers and a pair of LRM-10. So it's basically, it's basically a baby catapult. 10,000 sea bills. That's not bad. All right. Well. I'm going to call it a night, and we will probably do this again tomorrow. So good night, everyone, and thanks for watching.